Welcome back to the channel, I'm RJ Ron Kilio. If you're new here, thanks for joining me. Today we're going to be checking out the newest device from NuX. It's the Mighty Plug Pro MP3. NuX was kind enough to send me one to demo, so I'm going to check it out with you guys today. So the Mighty Plug Pro is the newest addition to their Mighty Plug headphone amp line. You might remember a while back I demoed the MP2, the Mighty Plug, and what I'm hearing about the Mighty Plug Pro is that there's a ton of new features, some more amp models, more IRs, more effects. The new app has some extra features as well, but in this video I want to check out some of the new added features, plug it in for the first time and just check out some of the default sounds and presets, and then go into the app and start playing around with some of the new sounds and see what kind of cool stuff we can come up with. But before we get started, if you're into these kinds of videos, make sure you click the subscribe button and hit the bell icon to stay notified of whenever I go live or release a new video. So this retails for $109 US and some of the new added features to this are the USB-C port, which allows you to do direct recording to the computer. So this kind of doubles as like a audio interface of sorts. So instead of taking a cable from the headphone jack into your audio interface into your computer, you can bypass all of that and just take USB right into your computer and start recording in whatever software you use. Another way to use the USB-C port is for live streaming, uh, let's say on your smart device. I know there's a couple social media platforms that only allow live streaming from your smartphone or your tablet, such as Instagram Live and TikTok. So you can use a USB cable to go from the Mighty Plug Pro into your smartphone. You probably would need an adapter for that. And you can actually plug into the headphone jack uh, earbuds with a microphone or like a headset with a microphone. And that allows you to not only hear what you're doing and monitor what you're doing on your live stream, but also send your guitar signal as well as a, a mic signal. As far as additions to the sounds and tones, this has a couple more amps, it has a couple more effects, and it has 36 built-in IRs uh, with 18 empty slots for third-party IRs. So you can actually load in your own IRs. And if you're not familiar with IRs, they're basically like speaker cabinet simulation. And now you can change the order of the effect blocks within the app, which I'm gonna show you a little bit later. Now you can start using this device right out of the box. There's a couple presets loaded onto this, which we're gonna check out, but you can also hook this up with a couple apps that NuX provides. There's an app called Mighty Amp, which you would install either on your smartphone or your tablet, as well as the Mighty Editor, which is for your desktop, PC, or Mac. So I've got the uh, Mighty Plug Pro plugged into my Tyler Strat. And I'm just gonna go through the default presets and the default sounds. We've got a green channel, kind of an orange yellow channel, red, blue, light blue, pink, white, and back to green. So keep in mind, this is just the default presets. This is what you would hear when you just kind of open the box and plug it in. The controls on the actual unit are very simple and limited. You've got the preset button and then you've got volume. So when you have your headphones plugged in, I'm plugged in right to my audio interface for the purposes of this video. But uh, if you want to get into editing all these presets and really deep deep tweaking, uh, it's gonna be in the app, which I'm gonna show you after this. Okay, so here is the green preset, which I believe is clean. A little bit of reverb. This is the orange or yellow color. A little bit of a uh, kind of slap echo. Now keep in mind, I have no idea what the names of these presets are, nor do I know exactly what amp it is or the effects that are on it. We'll find out later once we get into the app. This is red. Now we get into the gainy stuff. Here's blue. Ooh. A little bit of a panning delay, or ping pong delay, I should say.
This is the light blue. So I hear reverb, delay, and a sort of a shimmer. This is pink. This is clear. Ooh. Almost acoustic like. I think this might be an acoustic sim or acoustic amp. Okay, now I have it hooked up to the Mighty Amp app. There's a couple more knobs I can see. Uh, there's a couple more effects blocks I can see. Preset number one, which is the green one. And now we can see what amp it was. So we were using uh, a Jazz Clean. And in the uh, row here with all the effects blocks, you can just tap on any of them. And the ones that are colored are the ones that are active, obviously. But if we wanted to go to effects and say, hey, let's put, um, I don't know, a Tube Screamer. Hit that, and then I guess hit this power button. Now we have a Tube Screamer in front of the amp. And we can control all of the uh, knobs on a real Tube Screamer. We got the drive. Tone. Level. Tube Screamer in front of a jazz chorus amp is not necessarily my perfect tone, but just for demonstration purposes, we've got a gate, so a noise gate if you want to uh, control any buzzing. Gone. We got a compressor, a couple compressors, Rose Comp, K Comp, Studio Comp. That's always nice to have. And with these, I believe you can just drag them anywhere. You can even put it after the IR, if you'd like. So under effects, this is actually where your uh, overdrive and distortion and fuzz stuff is going to be, because uh, they've separated, you know, effects, which is kind of your drive pedals, delay, and then we're going to jump up here to EQ, if you want 6-band, 10-band, and then the modulation. And remember, you can move this wherever you want, so if I want modulation, before the delay, I can just put it there. Okay, so I want to check out some of the uh, effects blocks, and some of the effects are actually new. Let's start with EFX, which like I said is kind of the drive stuff. So I'm basically going through Class A30 Vox style amp, and I changed the IR to a Deluxe Reverb 112 to mellow it out a little bit. Here's my clean sound. Distortion Plus. RC Boost. Sorry, that was AC Boost. RC Boost. Here's Morning Drive. I'm assuming it's like a JHS Morning Glory, maybe. Let's check out some of the fuzzy stuff, Muff Fuzz. Ka 
Katana. Keely Katana boost. That's kind of cool. ST Singer. Oh, that's kind of like a Dumble style. Uh, let's move on to some of the delay sounds. Analog. Digital. Modulation. So the modulation stuff, there's a lot of. Uh, let's try the CE1 chorus. Compared to the CE2 chorus. Totally different sounds, totally different controls. You know what? Phase 90, that's always a good effect. Univibe, I'm a Hendrix fan, so... Chorus. No. Oh, okay. So, I think they might have it backwards. Usually on a real Univibe, the chorus mode gives you that Hendrixy thing, which I believe this is what on vi what uh, they're doing on vibrato mode on their app. Kind of sounds like a phaser. But the chorus mode on here is actually more like the vibrato mode on a real um, Univibe. Ooh, rotary. So let's see, let's go to 10 band. If I want to dial out some harshness, I can. This is starting to get more closer to like a Line 6 Helix type device, which I like because it's essentially this small of a device plus the app. Some other features on the app that are really interesting other than the amp tweak ability, you've got uh, a drum machine so you can practice to uh, different beats if you'd like. Uh, one of the cool features of the app has always been uh, being able to play with jam tracks. Uh, here's settings for the microphone. So when you're doing your live streaming and you have your headset with the mic plugged in, you can actually have some control over the volume as well as a noise gate uh, with that, which is super cool. Okay, guys, there you have it. That was the new X Mighty Plug Pro MP3. If you want more info on it and how to buy it, I'll put links down in the description. Thanks again for watching this video. If you liked it, please click that thumbs up. Thanks again to NewX for sending me the Mighty Plug Pro. And if you'd like to see more videos like this, gear demos and guitar lessons, click that subscribe button. I'm RJ Ronquillo and I'll see you in the next video.